Good morning students of class 3. In today's video, I am going to explain first chapter from your English literature course book, Viva Connect. Lesson 1 is a poem, A Good Boy, whose author is R. L. Stevenson. Now student, who was R. L. Stevenson? He was the poet of this poem. His full name was Robert Louis Balfour Stevenson. He was a Scottish novelist, essayist and poet. His famous work are Treasure Island, Kidnapped, Mr. Hyde, etc. Here are some new words that you will come across while reading the poem. First is ugly words that means bad words. Gandhi Shabd. The second is stuck to play, kept playing, khelte rehna. Third, the sun is going down behind the wood, which means the sun is setting, suraj ka dubna. Fourth, linen, bed sheets or bed clothes. Next, fair, which means beautiful, khubsurat. Next is off to sleep, go to sleep. Sojana. Next, fright. Frighten, which means darjana. Dawn, the time just before sunrise. Sunrise ke pehle ka time. Thrush, a song, bird. Lalak, a shrub with sweet smelling flowers. Now, moving on to the poem. A good boy. I woke before the morning. I was happy all the day. I never said an ugly word but smiled and stuck to play. And now at last the sun is going down behind the wood. And I am very happy for I know that I have been good. My bed is waiting cool and fresh with line and smooth and fair. And I must off to sleep and by and not forget my prayer. I know that till morning I shall see the sun arise. No ugly dream shall fright my mind. No ugly sight my eyes. But slumber hold me tightly till I wake in the down and hear the thrushes singing in the lilac round the lawn. Now let us see what, this, what does this poem mean. Good Boy is a simple poem by the poet and just tells the simple day-to-day -day activity a small boy would follow. In this poem, the poet says that he wakes up at the dawn and tries to be good boy throughout the day. He never tries to speak a bad word and always stick to his games. When the sun goes down and the, when the day is about to end, he feels happy for himself and he makes sure that he stays good and make other also feel the same. At bedtime, he makes sure he does not forget his prayer and thanksgiving. He makes he has a set of routine that he follows, a time to rise, a time to sleep in his soft linen laid bed. Now, in the last para, he says, Till he wake the next day morning, he would not like to have any nightmare or see any sight that he does not desire or frighten him. His sleep hold him tight till he see the next day dawn and hear the birds chirping. So in short we can say that this poem could be read to every child to make them understand the importance of being good and how one should follow everyday routine. I hope this session is clear to you. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe the channel. Thank you.